they're just always so supportive and it's just another thing for them to all come together for and be a family because they did it with Bob and now they'll do it with Dave. I am so excited to be here. This is my first time ever presenting at an award show, so it's a big deal. So obviously you've been the spotlight. Everyone kind of wants to know, how is you and your relationship going with Brecken? Brecken is just an absolute dream. He's so wonderful, so kind, so supportive, and I just got so, so lucky. I mean, I just hear so many horror stories of even dating, especially in your 40s, and especially after what I went through. I was not looking forward to it, and I just got very, very, very lucky with Brecken. So. Now, we also have seen things that unfortunately Dave and Dave from Gloss announced that he unfortunately died of cancer. I'm curious, have you spoken to Dave at all since the yeah. since the news? Yeah, well, I had known for a bit before it was announced. I've spoken to him. I've been in very close contact with his wife Mel a lot. She's been giving me a lot of updates about, you know, his treatments and progress. I was just very relieved because when everyone found out the news, that's also when I found out that it was negative for his bone marrow, which is a huge, huge, huge plus and, you know, makes everything just so much better for his outlook. So I'm, I was so grateful to hear that news very recently. So I just know he's going to be fine because he has no choice. <laughs> Do you feel we as a, all need him. Yeah. Do you feel as the rest of the cast come together to band together during these really difficult times? Do you talk to the rest of the cast and stuff like that? Yeah, so I haven't talked to too many since the Dave news has broken. Like I've obviously been talking to him and to his wife, but um because I wanted to wait for the rest of the cast for it to kind of sink in with them and everything for, you know, like Candace and John and Jody. Um, but now that everyone's in the know and talking about it, I'm definitely going to talk to them soon. I mean, they're just always so supportive, and it's just another thing for them to all come together for and be a family, because they did it with Bob, and now they'll do it with Dave. How are you doing during all of this? How are you doing, and what can fans expect to see from you next? I'm doing really well. Thank you for asking. Just really trying to live life to its fullest, enjoy life. I mean, as we know, you can't plan life. That's been the biggest thing that I've learned throughout everything is you can't plan life. So every day that we have is a gift and a blessing. So I try to make the best of it. Um, I've been really excited focusing on my comfort club, which is my membership that I started just about a month and a half ago. And it's already been so helpful for people. So it's a membership where people who have gone through a tough time or a loss or grief can kind of come together and find community. So it's been really, really wonderful. So I'm so excited for that, especially going into the holiday season.